Okay, so I have been asked what are my thoughts on Conjurer's placement in the hierarchy of Arcane Odyssey's tier list. And instead of doing a complete tier list video, I'm simply going over my thoughts on Conjurer's current placement and other styles as well in update 1.12. First question is, are Conjurer's S tier? I don't think so. Conjurer last update was definitely low on the tier list due to it being overshadowed by some meta classes and builds like Mage, Crystal Warlock, Iron Leg Warlord, and much more. Currently, all classes have been balanced besides one in particular, Warlord. Conjurer right now is on par with Mage, Warlock, and Warrior. If you played Conjurer mostly for the first month of the game's release, you should have been able to improve your skills and now can transfer what you learn to some harder classes like Berserker or Savin. Right now, Conjurer is really good against Mages, and some people might argue that Mage has been nerfed to the ground which makes Conjurer the best class, but that is simply not true. Conjurer is just as good as Mage, and it really depends on your playstyle. I'd say that in my opinion, Conjurer is the perfect class for anyone who is just starting to play this game, as it shows you the fundamentals that you need in order to play every other class in this game in PvP. You learn how to use weapons which can be used by Knight, Warrior, and Warlord. You learn to use magic which is used by Warlocks, Mages, and Paladins and you learn to land rush attacks which can be used by berserkers, warlocks, juggernauts, and warlords. With all these basic fundamentals being learned right away, it's easy for the conjurer main to switch to another class which might be more proficient in the fundamentals I explain here. Thanks for watching, my goal is to reach 2000 subscribers in 2 months, let's make it happen. I will be hosting a PvP tournament next week, the discord is down below, and make sure you join, I'll see you guys in the next video.